Hello everyone and welcome back to 50 plus luxury style. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I'm so excited about today's video. I've been wanting to film it for weeks now and haven't had a chance, but I need to share with you what I picked up at Chanel in Las Vegas. And I'm going to need your advice as to whether I should keep this or not. If you want to find out what's in this box, well, then just keep on watching. This bag is from the 21K collection. I happened to be in Las Vegas a few days before the collection dropped. I had visited various boutiques wanting to see if I could get my hands on a bag very similar to this one to no avail of course they were already pre-sold on a list whatever you want i pretty much resigned myself to i'm not going to be able to get it ended up going to the chanel and the bellagio shops uh, refer to an essay there by my good friend lala and i will link her channel down below purchased an iridescent card holder and I'll link that video up above and while I was there this cutie appeared she had already been put aside for a customer and apparently the customer last minute decided they didn't want her I happened to be there right time right place didn't really think about it much and just bought her that all being said Let's open her up and then we can keep on talking about what to do with this bag. I've already unboxed her. I'll go ahead and put the footage up here. But other than that, quite frankly, I have not opened her up. Here she is. No matter what I do, I always tear this apart. It is the mini, extra mini cocoa handle in the pink iridescent color. Look at this. Oh my goodness. I can't. I am starstruck. <laughs> this is the extra mini cocoa handle grained calfskin with the iridescent or gradient metallic with the rainbow hardware and I hope the lighting is not great but I hope that you are kind of getting a decent idea of the color now I wanted the small. I, I was just lucky to even get the extra mini. Again, 21K. And it just says pink. That's the color that the tag has. It's just like your regular cocoa handle. It's got the beautiful handle right here. And then it's got the chain and I have not even unwrapped the chain to be frank because I wanted to show her to you and I'm not quite sure if I want to keep it. Not because I don't love her, but if you know me, I like big bags and this is really, really small. To give you an idea, and these are not, these are my measurements, they're not from the website. If you know where we can get the actual measurements, please leave me a comment down below. I measured it and I think the base is eight inches. The height up to here is five inches. And the width at the right here is three and a half. That's what I measured. Again, not scientific measuring here. All right. The other beautiful thing is it has silver hardware. Okay, 
here are the clasps, the removable clasps, which I'm going to take off so that we can open her up together. Of course, I still have the plastic on everything, including right here. Oh, it's just, just gorgeous. Okay, okay, let's go ahead and take this off so we can get a better idea. It's just, okay, we're gonna put this right over here. And I'm sorry, this, the, my room is a disaster. I was, we had construction and different things going on. That's a whole other story. Okay, here she is. I mean, look how small she is. <laughs> okay, let's open her up. Here we have the regular turnkey clasp. And let's take this off. And try and, she's still stuck. And the interior is like our regular cocoa handles. It's got the zippered compartment in the back. It has two separate compartments. And this has a slip pocket here in the middle. And the, the one thing that is different from the cocoa handle that I currently own is that this one is now full leather interior. And of course it does have the microchip. So there, that's where the microchip is. And again, the silver hardware. Oh, look at this just adorable of course she has feet and here she is um you can put it on your wrist like this so it's very small but you can do that and she is just absolutely adorable and i have been really 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 wanting a pink cocoa handle and could never get my hands on one with a color that i liked so when i had the opportunity to snag this one i just i just bought it what do you think oh she is so freaking adorable let me know in the comments down below what you think. I will do a what fits in my bag very, very soon, but I wanted to at least unbox this and show it to you. Get your input because it's been in the box since I think, I mean, it's, it's, it's like three weeks, I think. Oh, and let me give you a very quick size comparison to the medium cocoa handle that I have. All right, this is my cocoa handle. It's the regular flap, medium size. So I think their new sizes are the extra mini, the mini, which they may call the small. And then this one, I think they just call it the cocoa handle. So it's the medium. And there is the size comparison between them. It's like mommy and her little baby. <laughs> they both have the beautiful Mona Lisa pocket in the back. And yep, there it is. Considerably, considerably a smaller bag. But oh, so beautiful. All right, I, I will let you know the cost. I have the receipt here. Give me one second. Put this here. Okay, so for this, again, I purchased this at the Bellagio and what day was this? September 14th, exactly which was the day the collection dropped and it was $4,400 before tax. So, all right guys, that's it. I will go ahead and do a what's in my bag. 
I will let you know that my cell phone, which is an 11, iPhone 11, does fit in it. Now, I don't think that the 13 Pro and Max, I don't think any of those are gonna fit in this, but I will give you a little more in-depth what's in my bag and a little tour of the bag within a week. And in the meantime, let's see if you can just try to show you the color. It is so, so pretty. Anyway, yes, I'm just giddy for, for somebody who's uh, 58 years old getting so giddy over a bag. I'm not even quite sure what's happened. But anyway, let me know in the comments down below what you think. Here she is. This is what I picked up at the Bellagio Chanel in Vegas. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you soon. Bye.